to the troops, uh, more, spe more specifically also to the members of the WESCOM who conducted the RORE mission to Ayungin Shoal last June 17. The President gave his commitment and resolve to support our dedicated and courageous men and women in the armed forces in their fight to defend our territory. As he mentioned in his speech yesterday, and I quote, history itself can tell that we have never, never in the Philippines yielded to any foreign power. We owe to our forefathers the duty to keep the freedoms that they fought, bled, and died for, and that they presently enjoy. Kailanman ay hindi tayo magpapasupil at magpapaapi kahit sa kanino man. We would also like to categorically state that our policy in the West Philippine Sea has not changed. As declared by the President in numerous instances, we will not give up an inch, not even a millimeter of our territory to any foreign power. We will continue to defend our territory and exercise sovereign rights thereon as we see fit. We reiterate that we seek neither permission nor consent from anyone in performing our sworn duties in the West Philippine Sea. In this regard, we will continue our rotation and resupply missions on a regular basis. The welfare of our troops in the uh, BRP Sierra Madre being a matter of utmost importance. The President has reiterated that we will not publish schedules of any RORE. We see the latest incident in Ayungin, not as a misunderstanding or an accident. It is a deliberate act of the Chinese officialdom to prevent us from completing our mission. After our visit to our troops in Palawan yesterday, where the President personally <coughs> talked to the troops involved in the RORE, we have now come to an understanding to the conclusion that it was not a misunderstanding or an accident. We are not downplaying the incident. It was an aggressive and illegal use of force. We, however, continue to find peaceful solutions to this issue, as pointed out by the President, and I quote, we are not in the business to instigate wars. The Philippines is a responsible state. We will continue to exercise our freedoms and rights in support of our national interest in accordance with international law." Unquote. The President was inspired by the bravery and commitment of our soldiers in WESCOM. And they can be assured of the entire support of the armed forces and this administration in carrying out their duties to protect our territorial integrity, sovereignty, and sovereign rights. Thank you very much.